Welcome to this tutorial on how to convert HTML to PDF in Node.js. How's it going, everyone? Welcome to today's tutorial. We're going to learn how to convert HTML to PDF using Iron PDF in Node.js. Today, we're in VS Code, and we're all set to begin our journey into PDF generation. So for things first, let's get our environment set up. So we start by installing the Iron PDF Node package, and this package is crucial for our PDF generation. Next, we need Iron PDF binaries. So for Windows X64 systems, the command is npm install at ironsoftware slash ironpdf dash engine dash windows dash x64. So this step ensures basically that we have all the necessary components for Iron PDF to work seamlessly in our machine. So with our setup complete, let's explore the HTML to PDF.js file. We begin by importing the PDF document and Iron PDF global config from at Iron Software slash Iron PDF. These imports are the building blocks of our PDF creation process. We then create an asynchronous function named create PDFs. And within this function, we first set up our Iron PDF configuration. So this involves inputting a license key, which is essential for unlocking all the Iron PDF features. So our first task is to create a PDF from a simple HTML string. So think of it as a hello world uh, for the PDF world. And we do this using PDF document dot from HTML and then pass a basic HTML string to it. Next, we move to converting an HTML file to a PDF. And this showcases Iron's ability to handle external HTML sources, which makes it really versatile. And then lastly, we'll convert a web page into a PDF. And this is particularly exciting because it demonstrates Iron PDF's ability to convert entire web pages to PDF format. And before we run the script, just a quick reminder to update the package.json file with input colon module, enabling us to use ES6 modules. So let's see our code in action. I'm running the script with node HTML to PDF.js. And this will initiate the process of PDF generation based on our code. So we have three of them, one from an HTML string, one from an HTML file, and then one from a URL. The first PDF created from an HTML string showcased the basic but powerful rendering capability of Iron PDF. It's simple but perfect for quick PDF generation tasks. So moving to our second PDF generated from the HTML file, we see how Iron PDF handles complex HTML structures. The rendering, as you can see, is precise, maintaining the layout and style. And finally, a PDF from a URL. And I think this is where Iron PDF truly shines. The pixel perfect representation of the web page, capturing the essence of the web content, but in a static PDF format. And that wraps up our tutorial. As you can see, Iron PDF is perfect for generating invoices, reports, or capturing web content and putting it all into PDF format. All right, we hope you found this tutorial helpful. Don't forget to subscribe if you'd like some more useful tutorials from Iron Software. And if you're eager to try out Iron PDF and Node.js, you can click on the link in the description down below. That'll take you to our website where you can sign up for the trial, download and install the package, and check out the power of Iron PDF for yourself.